Welcome to the fascinating world of a classic television series that captured the imaginations of viewers in the late 1960s Land of the Giants. As we delve into the lesser known aspects of this iconic show, consider this. Are there any intriguing anecdotes or facts about Land of the Giants that have piqued your interest over the years? Land of the Giants, a sci-fi series created by Irwin Allen, unfolded on the small screen in the turbulent year of 1968 blending suspense, adventure, and futuristic elements. Its narrative, set in an otherworldly landscape where a group of individuals find themselves trapped in a land of colossal proportions, struck a chord with audiences. Now, back to our initial query what might surprise you about the making of Land of the Giants. From behind the scenes quirks to unexpected challenges faced by the cast and crew, the production of this series holds its own set of captivating tales. These behind-the-camera narratives add an extra layer of intrigue to the on-screen escapades, providing a richer understanding of the show's journey from concept to execution. Before we continue, allow me to pose a question. Have you ever experienced a moment in your life where Land of the Giants played a role in inspiring or impacting you? The show's timeless appeal has often transcended the screen leaving lasting impressions on individuals who found themselves captivated by its narrative. Feel free to share your personal stories in the comments below. We'd love to hear about the ways Land of the Giants has become intertwined with your own life. As we navigate through the random facts and anecdotes, keep in mind the cherished memories or personal experiences you may have with Land of the Giants. Whether it's a nostalgic recollection of watching the series with loved ones or a moment where the show unexpectedly influenced your perspective, we invite you to share your stories. So, what are some of the hidden gems that make Land of the Giants a truly iconic series? Join us on this journey through time and imagination, exploring the depths of a show that left an indelible mark on the landscape of television history. Your stories and memories are a vital part of this shared experience, so please share them in the comments below. We look forward to hearing your reflections on Land of the Giants and the impact it has had on your life. In the late 1960s, television audiences were transported to a mesmerizing realm where a group of diverse characters found themselves marooned in a bizarre and oversized world. Land of the Giants, a science fiction TV series that emerged in 1968, captivated viewers with its unique blend of adventure, suspense, and imaginative storytelling. The show, created by legendary producer Irwin Allen, followed the journey of the spaceship Spindrift and its eclectic crew, who crash-landed on a mysterious planet where everything, from flora to fauna, towered over them in colossal proportions. As the castaways grappled with the challenges of their Lilliputian existence, iconic characters like Captain Steve Burton and Valerie Scott emerged as central figures in the struggle for survival and escape. The series, marked by its groundbreaking special effects for the time, showcased a remarkable visual style that brought the fantastical world to life. Its impact on popular culture was profound, influencing subsequent sci-fi narratives and leaving an indelible mark on the collective imagination of television enthusiasts. Land of the Giants remains a timeless testament to the creative ingenuity of its era, offering audiences a thrilling escape into a world where the ordinary became extraordinary, all within the confines of the small screen. Land of the Giants, a groundbreaking TV series from the late 1960s, holds a unique production history. To manage costs, the show repurposed oversized props from Universal Studios' prop store, originally crafted for the incredible Shrinking Man. This strategic move saved both money and storage space, showcasing the practical ingenuity behind the scenes. Notably, the debut of Land of the Giants marked a milestone in television production. At the time, it stood as the most expensive show ever created for the small screen. This financial investment underscored the ambition and commitment to delivering an unparalleled viewing experience to audiences. The attention to detail in the series extended to the design of the Spindrift's cabin chairs. Surprisingly, these chairs shared a common lineage with the spaceship seen in Planet of the Apes, a concurrent production at 20th Century Fox in the summer of 1967. The continuity in design elements highlights the interconnectedness of sci-fi productions during this era. In summary, Land of the Giants not only mesmerized viewers with its captivating storyline but also made strategic choices in production, emphasizing efficiency and cost-effectiveness. 
The show's commitment to quality and innovation set it apart in the television landscape of its time. In the early stages of development, Land of the Giants underwent some notable changes. Erwin Allen, the show's creator, presented a six-minute preview to network executives, featuring a different storyline. The main character, initially named Tim Burton, eventually became Steve, and Fitzhugh started as Peter Lindelhopper. Notably absent was Valerie. Originally, a female doctor named Joan Templeton was planned as the second female castaway. She was on her way to a science conference in London. Mad Magazine later playfully spoofed the series as Land of the Giant Boars. This satirical take reflected the show's impact on popular culture. During the second season, actress Heather Young, who portrayed stewardess Betty Hamilton, faced a unique challenge. Her pregnancy led to creative solutions like filming her mostly from the waist up, incorporating baggy outfits, or occasionally writing her character out of episodes. These behind-the-scenes insights into Land of the Giants add layers to the show's narrative, showcasing the creative evolution and the practical challenges faced during production. The cancellation of the TV series came as a surprise to many, considering its moderate success. However, a key contributing factor was the hefty budget, reaching nearly $250,000 per episode. The financial strain played a role in the decision to end the show. Interestingly, the Spindrift, the spaceship at the center of the series, had a designated flight number 612. This small detail added a layer of realism to the sci-fi narrative, creating a sense of authenticity for viewers. In a unique crossover of entertainment mediums, comic book artist Alex Ross drew inspiration from the show's actors, Gary Conway and Deanna Lund. Ross used their visual likeness for the characters Reed Richards and Sue Storm in the comic series Fantastic Four, Full Circle. These behind-the-scenes insights into the show's budget challenges, meticulous details like the flight number, and unexpected connections to the world of comics offer a glimpse into the multifaceted impact of the 1968 TV series. The blend of financial constraints, attention to detail, and unexpected influences shaped the course of the show and its legacy in popular culture. As we bid adieu to this mesmerizing journey through the colossal wonders of a bygone era, let your mind linger on the enchanting landscapes of the small screen. Land of the Giants, a tapestry woven with threads of mystery, adventure, and ingenuity, has undoubtedly etched itself into the annals of timeless television. As the curtains fall on our exploration, I invite you, dear reader, to delve into the recesses of your memories, summoning forth the echoes of the giant footsteps that once reverberated through your imagination. What moments from this legendary series have taken residence in your mind? Was it the ingenious escapades, the looming shadows of giants, or perhaps the subtle threads of camaraderie woven through the narrative? Feel free to share your musings, your tales spun in the vast tapestry of Land of the Giants. Whether it's a whispered nostalgia or a triumphant revelation, your words contribute to the collective symphony of appreciation for this masterpiece. As we navigate the currents of time, let us not forget the magic that resides in the pixels of yesteryears. Your reflections are the compass points that guide us back to the heart of this remarkable journey. So, dear reader, take a moment to pen down your thoughts, share your stories, and let the magic of Land of the Giants live on in the tales we tell. Thank you for embarking on this adventure with me and for lending your imagination to the realms of giants and minuscule heroes. Your time and musings are cherished, and it is through our shared love for these narratives that the magic endures. Until the next voyage into the realms of storytelling, revel in the memories, and let your words be the beacon that keeps the spirit of Land of the Giants alive.